English, the Daily Star Spelling Bee, powered by Horlicks, brought to you by Champs21.com. I'm Ramana Malik Moonmoon, along with Mr. Imtiaz Nasher, our official pronouncer, will take you through this journey. On the journey, we have a lot of golf. The golf is a lot of spelling. We have a lot of golf. 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 We have a lot of ट्रॉफी पाशे पाशे पेते जाते हैं, आमादे चैम्पियन्स पेलर शुद्र अमेरिका है। वाशिंगटन डिसी ते एक जनों भी भावुक शाहों प्रोमोने शुजो, शेष शाथे पांच लोक हो जाकर मेट लाइफ वैली को शिक खबे मार। ऑल राइट नाउ वी गो अहेर एंड मीट आवर सिक्स ब्यूटीफुल पार्टिसिपेंट्स ओवर हियर। आवर फर्स्ट after that, we have Warish Zaman from Dhaka Mastermind School. Writing stories is his hobby. Our second girl in the contest, Samin Azhan Chaudhuri, student of Scholar's Home, Silet. Writing is also her hobby. Wow, okay. Then we have got representative from Chittagong, student of Kumilla Cadet College, Hasin Mizbah bin Siddiq. Reading novels is his favorite pastime. Okay. And the third girl in the contest, Nabila Rubayat, student of Holy Cross Girls School, Dhaka. Your hobby is traveling. Wow, wonderful. Beautiful. And the last contestant for today's contest, Ahmed Ishtiak, student of BAF Shaheen English Medium School, Dhaka. He loves listening to music. Good. Welcome, everyone. We are all set to start our competition, and our first round is Spell It. तुम्हारे प्रत्येक के पाँच टी शब्दों स्पेल करते होंगे। 20 सेकंड्स से मध्य स्पेलिंग शुरू करते होंगे। In the meantime, Mr. Imtiaz will provide you with three clues: English meaning, Bangla meaning, and parts of speech. Short एक शब्द बोलते पड़ ले, 10 points, so you have a chance to score 50 points in the first round, and I'm sure you all can make it. So all the best. We start with you, Maisha. All the best. Maisha, the first word for you is numerous. Sorry. It's numerous. N U M E R O U S. Numerous. That is correct. Oh, that was quite fast. Wonderful. Ten points, Masha. Word number two is uncanny. Can you give me the Bengali St meaning, please? Oshabhabik, which means strange and difficult to explain. U N C A N I N E. Uncanny. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is U N C A N N Y. The next word for you is effervescent. Effervescent. Vescent. A F F I R V A C A N T. Effervescent. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is E F F E R V E S C E N T. All right. You can take your time a little bit. There is 20 seconds, so go slow. All the best. Fourth word. The next word for you is hallucination. Hallucination. Exactly. H A L L. U C I N A T I O N Hallucination. That is correct. Okay, well done. Well done, Maisha. Good. 20 points. The final word for you is paleontology. 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 Exactly. P A L L I O N. T H O L O G Y, paleontology. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is P A L A E O N T O L O G Y. All right, well tried, Maisha. You got 20 points in the first round. Well tried. Good. Are you ready, Warish? All the best. Warish, the first word for you is anodyne. Ano? Dyne. Anodyne. Anodyne. Exactly. The definition, please. A painkilling drug or medicine. A N O D I N E. Anodyne. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is A N O D Y N E. The next word for you is factitious. Definition? Specially contrived artificially. Factitious. F A C T 
I T I O U S. Factitious. That is correct. There you go. Ten points. Good Morris. Good. The next word for you is effeminacy. 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 E F F E M I N A C Y. Effeminacy. That is correct. Beautiful. Good. Very good. Ten points. Word number four is haberdasher. Haberdasher. Haberdasher is the word. H A B E R D A S H E R. Haberdasher. That is correct. Whoa, wonderful, Morris. 30 points. Very good. The next word for you is septuagenarian. 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 Exactly. S E P T W A G E N A R I N. Septuagenarian. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It's S E P T U A G E N A R I A N. Well, well tried. You got your 30 points from the first round. Very good. Moving on to Samin. Ready? Okay. Yes. Samin, the first word for you is apathetic. Apathetic. A P A T H E T I C. Apathetic. That is correct. Beautiful. 10 points. The next word for you is facetious. Facetious. Facetious or facetious? F A C E T I O U S. Facetious. That is correct. Wonderful. Brilliant. Very good. Two on two. Very good. The next word is sepulchral. Krull. Krull. Sepulchral. S Y P O L C R A L. Sepulchral. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is S E P U L C H R A L. The next word for you is spontaneous. S P O N T A N E O U S. Spontaneous. That is correct. Whoa! Very spontaneous. Good. Wonderful. The next word is racketeer. Can I have the meaning? A person who makes money through dishonest or illegal activities. Racketeer. R A C K E T E E R. Racketeer. That is correct. Whoa, wonderful, wonderful done. So you had 40 points in the first round. Now moving on to Miss, are you ready? Yes. The first word for you is annex, which means take possession of. A-N-E-X, annex. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is A-N-N-E-X. All right. Take your time, go for the second one. Word number two for you is tedious. It's tedious, which means lasting or taking too long and not interesting. Is it tedious? It's tedious. 10 seconds. T-E-A-D-E-O-U-S, tedious. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It's T-E-D-I-O-U-S. Don't miss the easy words, please. Take your time, all the best. The next word for you is precipitous, which means dangerously high or steep. P-R-E. C E P I T O U S, precipitous. I'm sorry, that is not correct. The correct spelling is P R E C I P I T O U S. Don't worry, you still have got two more words. If you think you should write, use your pen and paper, then go for the word, okay? Relax, all the best. The next word for you is genealogy, which means a line of descent traced continuously from an ancestor. Can you please repeat it? It's genealogy. G E N E A L O G Y. Genealogy. That is correct. There you go. Miss Buck. Very good. 10 points. Good. And your last word is here. The final word for you is fortissimo. Could you repeat it? It's fortissimo, which means a very loud passage in music. F O R T I S I M O. Fortissimo. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It's F O R T I S S I M O. Oh, Miss by one letter. Don't worry, you still tried very well. Ten points from this round, Miss Bo. Good. And now from Chittagong to back to Dhaka. Nabila, ready? Okay, all the best. The first word for you is appendage. Appendage. Exactly, which means a thing that is added or attached to something larger or more important. A P P. E-N-D-A-G-E, appendage. That is correct. Good start, Nabila, 10 points. Word number two is whimsical. W-H-I-M-S-I-C-A-L. 
I C A L. Whimsical. That is correct. Go on, two, Nabila. Good going. Very good. The next word for you is inspicit or inspicate. Inspicate. Exactly. I N S P I S A T E. Inspicate. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It's I N S P I S S A T E. The next word for you is unceremonious. It's unceremonious. U N C E R E M O N I O U S. Unceremonious. That is correct. Good, Nabila. 30 points. And here's your last word. Your final word is Marque or Marquette which means a small-sized clay figure as a model for full-sized sculpture. M-A-R-Q-U-E-E-T, Marquette. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It's M-A-R-Q-U-E-T-T-E. -E -T -T -E. All right, well played. Nabila, you got 30 points from this round. Don't worry. Our last contestant, Ishtiak, ready to go. All the best. Ishtiak, the first word for you is wreath, which means a circle of smoke, cloud, etc. W-R-I-T-H-E. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It's W-R-E-A-T-H. All right, take your time, Ishtiak. Ready for the second one? Okay. Number two is barrage. Meaning, please? Which means an artificial barrier across a river. B-A-R-R-A-G-E, barrage. That is correct. Okay, 10 points, Ishtiak. Number three is xenophobia, which means a strong feeling of dislike or fear. Z-E-N-O-P-H-O-B-I-A, xenophobia. I'm sorry, that is not correct. It starts with an X, X-E-N-O-P-H-O-B-I-A. The next word for you is soliloque. Soliloque. Which means talking to oneself. It's soliloque. Quay or qui? Solilo quay or solilo qui? Five um, seconds, start. S O L I L O Q U Y. Say it. Solilo qui. That is correct. Oh, good. Wonderful. The next word is rambunctious. R A M B U N C T I O U S. Rambunctious. That is correct. Wonderful, Ishtiak. You got your 30 points. Wonderful. Well done, everyone. Very good. So, this brings us to the end of first round. Don't go anywhere because we are coming back with some exciting rounds after this short Horlix break. <laughs> We had our first round and now I would like to share with you some of our lots of prizes waiting for the winners. Our champion speller is a Chomutka Trophy. Trophy is a champion speller is a Washington DC. We have a lot of promoters. We have a lot of promoters. We have a lot of promoters. We have a lot of now back to our participants, let's take a quick look at your scores after the first round. Maisha is at 20 points. Well done, Maisha. Warish is at 30 points. Good. Saming, leading with 40 points. Good, Saming. Mesba is at 10 points. Well tried, Mesba. After that, Nabila at 30 points. Good. And Ishtiak is also at 30 points. Well tried, Ishtiak. All right. We are all set for the second round. On the second round, Hoche, spell high. Spell high. A round is the first time you have to say the first time. The first time you have to say the first time you have to say the first time you can ask for the clue, which will be the last letter of the first word. Now listen. First word is a four-letter word. These four letters will appear in every word. 
but you just have to add one more letter as you go down the hive. As I have said, protect a shop there journal, the other ten points, into Jodi Tumra clue near now, Prothom word and last letter. Shekhetre, first word will be five points, not ten. All right, so we can start our second round. All right, Maisha, are you ready? Maisha, here's your hive. The first word starts with an A, which means small insects that live in highly organized groups. Number two, to leave a mark that is difficult to remove on something. Number three, a large green insect that eats other insects. Number four, people living in an institution such as a prison. And finally, to show something clearly. And your time starts now. Letter? It's S. And spell it? A N T S. That is correct. Ten points. Come for the next one. Just add one more letter. Clue. A uh, clue. You need which word? Which word's clue? What do? Second one. We have the meaning. Your meaning. To leave a mark that is difficult to remove on something. You need the Bangla meaning? Yes. Sir. Okay. Dag lagano. That's the second one. You've got 40 seconds in your hand. You can try third, fourth, fifth if, if you can't get the second one. A large green insect that eats other insects is number three. 25 seconds left. People living in an institution, such as a prison, is number four. Last 10 seconds. Maisha, make it. Any, any, any word that comes in your mind, anything. Five seconds left, Maisha. time is up okay okay don't worry let's see what were the other words word number two was stain s-t-a-i-n number three was mantis m-a-n-t-i-s four inmates i-n-m-a-t-e-s and uh, number five was manifest m-a-n-i-f-e-s-t all right since you have taken clue for the first word you get five points for this round well tried we should give her an applause well tried Maisha okay so now it's Warish's turn ready to go all the best Warish Here's your hive. The first word starts with a T, which means a journey. Number two, a way that you follow to get from one place to another. Number three, a group of actors. Number four, the position in which you hold your body when standing or sitting. And number five, to produce new leaves or buds. And your time starts now. The first word is trip, T-R-I-P. I'm sorry, that is not correct. Okay, you can't. Go for this one. Go for the next one now. Oh. You won't get any points or can't try this anymore. Go for the second, third, fourth or fifth. You've got 70 seconds, more than a minute, so take your time. Go through the meaning. May I have the Bangla meaning of the fourth word? Deho Bhongi. The fourth word is posture. Spell it. P O S. T U R E. That is correct. Ten points. Warish, go for other words. Quickly. A way that you follow to get from one place to another is number two. Number, number two is R O U T E. Root. That is correct. Wonderful, Warish. You have got half a minute left. Go for the other two. Quickly. Group of actors, singers who work. The third together. word is troop. T R O U P E. Excellent. That is oh, correct. Oh, 30 points. Last word. Quickly. You have got just 10 seconds left. May I have the Bangla meaning of the last one? Omkuri Tohawa. Quickly. Three seconds left. All right. The time is up. You have answered three words, so you get 30 points from this round. Well done, Warish. Very good. Very good. Let's take a look at the words that you have missed, okay? Number one was tour, T-O-U-R, and number five was spreaded, S-P-R-O-U-T-E. All right, moving on 
to Samin. Samin, ready? Okay. Samin, here's your hive. The first word starts with an M. Which means something prepared. Number two, a series of images. Number three, to respect somebody for what they are or for what they have done. Number four, to read something wrongly. And finally, to fail to hear correctly when somebody says, so that you think that they said something else. And your time starts now. The first word is make, M-A-K-E. I'm sorry, that is not correct. All right, don't worry, go for the other one. You've got a minute in your hand. Take your time. Look at the meanings. A series of images, events, and feelings that happen in your mind while you are asleep is number two. Do you need any clue? Which one? Which one? Which word? The third one. Shraddha Bodh Kara. H O N O U R, third word. No. That is not correct. I'm sorry. All right, all right. Try the other one. Try the other one. Twenty seconds left. Any other word? Misread the fourth word. Spell it. M I S R E A D. That is correct. Ten points. Wonderful. 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 And five seconds left. Any more word? Any other word? Two seconds. Oh, okay, time up. Well done. You have tried it. You got your 10 points in the second round. Let's take a look at the other words. Number one was made, M-A-D-E. Ah. Number two, dream, D-R-E-A-M. Number three, admire, A-D-M-I-R-E. And number five, misheard, M-I-S-H-E-A-R-D. Okay, well tried. Well tried, Samin. Now moving on to Mesba. Mesba couldn't do quite well in the first round. This is your chance to get your scores, right? Relax and go for it. Mesba, here's your hive. The first word starts with a G, which means informal form of gentleman. Number two, a person whose job is to act for. Number three, to state that something does not exist. Number four, between 13 and 19 years old. And number five, to produce or create something. And your time starts now. The first word is gent, G-E-N-T. That is correct. Ten points, Ms. Well, go for the next one. Fourth word is teenage. T E E N A G E. That is correct as well. 20 points. Good going, Mesba. You've got enough time. You got whole minute, whole minute. So take your time. Go for the other one. Any other word? Second word is agent, A-G-E-N-T, agent. That is correct. 30 points, you have got half a minute left. Any so, other, any other clue you need? You need Bangla meaning for any word? To state that something does not exist is number three. Last 10 seconds. Five seconds left. The last word is managed. M-A-N-A-G-E-T. I'm sorry, that is not correct. Uh, okay, okay. Well tried, well tried. Well done. Okay, you got your 30 points from this round. Let's take a look what were the other two words. Number three was negate, N-E-G-A-T-E. -E. And number five was generate, G-E-N-E-R-A-T-E. -E. Okay, well tried, Ms. Ba. Moving on for Nabila. Nabila, ready to go? All the best. Nabila, here's your hive. The first word starts with a C, which means a small flat piece of metal used as money. Number two, a medicine that makes you feel stronger. Number three, the process of doing something in order to make something happen. Number four, the layer of, over something 
protecting. Number five, non-believer in a specific religion. And your time starts now. The first word is coin. Spell it. C-O-I-N. That is correct. Ten points. The fourth word is coating. C-O-A-T-I-N-G. Excellent, correct. Many points. A medicine that makes you feel stronger is number two. Last one is Nastik. The Bangla meaning is Nastik. Atheist. No. Spell it. Ah, uh, there's only four seconds left. Okay, time up. Time up, Navila. Okay, well done. You tried at least and you got your 10 points from this round. Don't worry, don't worry. You tried at least. Let's take a look at the other three words. Number two was tonic, T O N I C. Number three was action, A C T I O N. Number five was agnostic, A-G-N-O-S-T-I-C. Okay, so our last contestant, Ishtiak, ready. All the best. Ishtiak, here's your hive. The first word starts with an N, which means tidy and in order. Number two, concerning. Number three, a person whose job is to tan animal skins to make leather. Number four, a small remaining part. And finally, an object that is worn as jewelry. And your time starts now. The first word is neat, N-E-A-T. Spell it again. Neat, N-E-A-T. That is correct. Ten points. Next one. Add one more letter to it, you'll get the second one. Which means concerning. Number two is concerning. You can ask for other words, uh, clue or anything you want to go for. Concerning is Bangla meaning. Which word? Which word? Second word. Second word. Shamonde. You have got the third one. Third one. Bangla meaning? Charmo Baboshai. You've got thirty-three seconds, so quickly. Any other word that comes in your mind? Last one, go for the last one. Look at the meaning carefully. Last seven seconds, Ishtiak. Three seconds. Ah, oh, time up. Ishtiak, what happened to you? All right, don't worry. Let's take a look at the words. Number two was Anant, A N E N T. Number three was Tanner, T-A-N-N-E-R. Number four was Remnant, R-E-M-N-A-N-T. And number five was Ornament, O-R-N-A-M-E-N-T. All right, well done, everyone. So this brings us to the end of second round. And now we'll take another short Horlix break. Don't go anywhere because after this break, we'll come to know who are the two top scorers going for semifinals. Stay tuned. <laughs> the quarter-final round of the Daily Star Spelling Bee, powered by Horlix, brought to you by Champs21.com. You can also be a part of this Spelling Bee. We have a lot of words. 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 We have a l
পাঠানোর নিয়মটি বলে দিচ্ছি আপনাদের মোবাইলের মেসেজ অপশনে গিয়ে টাইপ করুন এস বি স্পেস দিয়ে রাইট ইউর সেন্টেন্স অ্যান্ড সেন্ড ইট টু ওয়ান সিক্স টু ফাইভ টু এই নম্বরে ইউ ক্যান সেন্ড অ্যাজ মেনি সেন্টেন্স ইউ ওয়ান্ট জাস্ট রিমেম্বার ইচ সেন্টেন্স হ্যাজ টু বি ইউনিক আমাদের আজকের পর্বের শব্দটি হচ্ছে ইউনিক ইউ এন আই কিউ ইউ ই ইউনিক এস এম এস পাঠানোর শেষ সময় আগামীকাল রাত আটটা গত পর্বের ভিউয়ার্স রাউন্ডের বিজয়ীর নাম জানতে হলে ডগ অন টু চ্যাম্পস টোয়েন্টি ওয়ান ডট কম অ্যান্ড ইয়েস ইউ ক্যান অলসো ডেভেলপ ইউর স্পেলিং স্কিল ইউজিং ইউর মোবাইল ফোন ফর দ্যাট ইউল হ্যাভ টু টাইপ স্টার্ট এস টি এ আর টি একটা স্পেস দিয়ে এস বি পাঠিয়ে দিন ওয়ান সিক্স টু ফাইভ টু এই নম্বরে প্রতিদিন আপনার মোবাইলে পৌঁছে যাবে একটি নতুন ইংরেজি শব্দ All right, so we are back after the short Holix break with our contestants. Let's take a look at your score after the second round. Maicha is at 25. <laughs> Warish at 60 points. <laughs> Samin is at 50 points. <laughs> Mezba at 40 points. <laughs> Nabila, you are at 50 points. <laughs> And Ishtiak at 40 points. Well done, well done. So we are all set for the third and final round. And our third and final round is Spell Buzz. This round is open for all. Now, A round day, you have to give a lot of words. Letter gulu gutsye, shotik shop to the other. Remember, this is a buzzer round. Je aage buzzer press korbe, she shujok pabe uttor dear. Tobe, shotik shabdu, jodi bolte paro, 10 points. Bhul bolle minus 5. So please be very careful before you press the buzzer. Make sure you get the correct word. Alright? And remember, this round is going to be the decisive round. A rounder performance report bhitti kore one ke semi final confirm kore chhe. So for you, this is a challenge. Those who are much behind by scores, you can score 100 points if you can get the words correctly. 10 words at a go. All right? So all the best. Relax. Go for the first one. Here's the first buzzword. Cables. C A B L E S. Cables. That is correct. Wonderful, Nabila. Wonderful. You got your 10 points. Here's the next buzzword. Yes, that's Amin from Silet. Baboon. Spell it. B A B O O N. Baboon. That is correct. Excellent. Wonderful, Samin. Got your 10 points. Here's the third buzzword. That's Mesba from Chittagong. Go for it. Say it, say it. H E R M E. Gone. Mesba, this is going to be expensive for you. You're losing five points from your total of 40. Can we know the word, please? It was hammer, H-A-M-M-E-R. All right, relax, Ms. Bai. Everyone, be careful. Make sure you have the word ready, then press the buzzer. Go Here's for the next Here's the next one. buzzword. Yes, Samin, once again. Louder, L-O-U-D-E-R, louder. That is correct. Wonderful, Samin, 20 points. Here's the next buzzword. Time up. Okay, we can't give any more time. Let's find out what was the word. It was abuses, A-B-U-S-E-S. Okay, okay, don't worry, there are more words for you. All the best. Here's the next buzzword. Yes, that's 
please Warish. abound. A B O U N D. That is correct. Wonderful, Warish. You got your 10 points. Very good. Here's the next buzzword. the word? The word was health. H-E-A-L-T-H. -E okay, be careful everyone. Here's the next buzzword. Yes, Samin, go for it. Mallow, M-A-L-L-O-W. That Mallow. is correct. And here's the next buzzword. And yes, Ishtiak, ready? Matter, M-A-T-T-E-R. That is correct. Whoa, good Ishtiak, you got your 10 points. Here's the last buzzword. Yes, Ishtiak, last word for you, go. Oh, Ishtiak, don't take time. Faster. Here. Spell it. F-A-S-T-E-R. That is correct. Whoa! That was fast enough, Ishtiak. You got it correct. Wonderful. All right. Well played, everyone. So now it's time to declare your final score. Let's take a look. Maisha from Kulna is at 25 points. Next, Mesba from Chittagong is at 35 points. Well played, Mesba. After that, Nabila from Dhaka at 55 points. Well done, Nabila. Ishtiak also from Dhaka at 60 points. Well played, Ishtiak. And now our two last contestants, Warish from Mastermind School Dhaka at 70 points. Well done, Warish. And Samin from Scholars Home Select at 80 points. Well done, Samin. Our two semi finalists come to PGHC, Warish and Samin. Congratulations. Congratulations to both of you. Warish and Samin, congratulations! Aki ki quarter final thi ke amra page achche amader semi finalist. Aar ek ta quarter final round baki. I'm sure you don't want to miss it. Tar jonno chok rakhun aga mikal channel ayer pot dai shon tha shakta ponchash minute. Till then we will keep saying goodbye spelling mistakes. Cool.